the worst that can happen is someone saying no to you. Right. Like, like even if you don't ask someone, like that's one of the things that I, I've learned throughout my life, especially from acting. Acting was one of the best ways for me to learn this was going out and doing auditions and everyone, like I would go out to do hundreds of auditions. No, 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 every single time. And it's not like it was anything that was my fault. Like this, the film industry was like very picky at the time. Like I was only 16, 17 years old. So I was only able to work a maximum amount of hours, which I didn't really understand at the time. Mm -hmm. So people wouldn't pick me because they wanted me to be on set for 16, 17 hours when I was only allowed to be there for eight. Sure. So that's why I wouldn't have gone pick. It wasn't anything that no matter my ability, no matter how I looked, it didn't really matter. Um, it, it only mattered for them at the end of the day if they're able to keep me longer than eight hours, which most film sets they do. So just being able to learn, learn to understand um, that no doesn't actually just mean no. No just means like, okay, just move on to whatever, just move on to something next and then maybe do a follow up maybe a month later. Because if I get told no by, because when I, when I was going out and doing meetings a few months ago, I would always get told no for our services, right. but I wouldn't really get discouraged by it because I would just do a, I don't know if you've heard of this program called Loom. Loom is one of the craziest unreal programs out there it's um it's a recording service where have you heard have you heard of loom chris no no i haven't it's a recording you're gonna this is gonna like <laughs> blow your mind so loom is my favorite thing to use for any sort of client work um any sort of uh, anything that i need to send off right away so uh it's a service where it's a screen recorder so it's a webcam and screen recorder um and it records everything so you just click play or whatever and then it comes up automatically onto your chrome server so you have to use it with chrome and um, as soon as you're done doing a video or a presentation, be it like five minutes, an hour or something like that, your uh, webcam's in like a little circle on like the bottom left of your screen. And as soon as it's done, a link comes up right away. Your video, you can send that link to anyone and it happens in a split second. <laughs> or you can download it. You can download the video, but that takes probably about like a couple minutes depending on how, how big the file is. But yeah. that video is accessible in a second. So all I do is just send looms out to, to, to follow up with people. So it literally takes 15 to 16 minutes for me to follow up with someone who said no, maybe a month ago, right. but then I offered them a whole bunch of like new value for like 15 minutes and show them, show them like step by step. And then, and then people are like, Whoa, no one ever really does this. Right. So, <laughs> so, so let me get this right. You're recording like a, basically a video tutorial type of thing and then sending it to clients or prospective clients that you're following up with. Yeah, yeah, it, all because of this Mark Zuckerberg thing about like after he went into like um, Congress or whatever back in mm -hmm. April, Facebook's had to implement. This is a, a tip for anyone that's looking into doing any sort of like Facebook ads or do any sort of digital marketing agency work. Go into info and ads on a business page and you'll be able to see all the ads that someone, uh, that a company or someone that's doing currently. So I'm able to go in and see these info and ads. And then all I do is just talk about the ads, talk about the copy, talk about like their call to action. Uh, I'm not too sure what the targeting is because that's all done on the back end, So I can't really see it, but I'm a big emphasis. I'm a big emphasizer on lookalike audiences and retargeting. That's the only reason why someone should do either Facebook ads or YouTube ads is if you already have a list available, if you already have your Facebook pixel installed on your website, and then you're able to do retargeting ads of people who visited your website or people that look like they, or would look like the people that visited your website or even an email list. Email lists are super important as well. I know email marketing kind of died maybe a few years ago, um, but it came back when Facebook uh, Facebook uh, would use these lists and then use their AI to go after a lookalike audience of that list. So say you had a thousand people that um, opted in for like, they bought something on your website. Mm -hmm. uh, you could then use that list to follow up with people that may seem like them. So they look like them and Facebook's able to like use their algorithm. Like, Hey, there's like these people like these types of pages. Oh, Hey, these people make this much amount of money. Like Facebook has all this information, which is kind of creepy, but you know what? <laughs> it's just the time that we live in and it's, it's a free service. So, and it's the best way um, for myself to uh, loom as a platform platform. It's the best way for me to like go over um, any potential clients, uh, any of their, um, 
either their lead generation forms, their advertisement, and then just kind of tell them which direction they're, they're able to go to. And then I just send off the loom in an email or I send it to them through Facebook Messenger and boom, it's, it's done. It literally takes 15, 16 minutes for you to like send over a video, which I think is crazy because I used to have to make an unlisted video on YouTube. I used to have to like record something and then right. upload it onto YouTube, which would take another 10, 10 to 25 minutes and then like have it unlisted and then send that link out. But now I don't have to do that. It's made my life a lot easier. Well, I appreciate that. And our listeners, I'm sure appreciate that, um, that nugget right there, Loom. As soon as we get off, I'm going on that website to, to figure it out, man, because that's always awesome.